Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another Pokemon Sun Wonderlock episode. Today we're starting off with something special. Well first off, I moved. I moved my entire desk over a little bit. So the lighting is a bit different. I'm not sure if I like it yet or not. It looks different. I'm very white on this side, which is the, the window right there. I'm willing to trade it on my other desk. Oh, that's the other thing that we need to start off with this episode. So if you guys didn't watch last episode, go watch it. <laughs> If you guys did not watch the last episode, go watch it. I'm over here because I have my other DS set up. And guess what Pokemon I just got off Wonder Trade? An Abra. Yay, what a surprise. I literally... So, two 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 things in a row. I wonder, I sat there Wonder Trading because I had nothing else to do with the DS. Um, so, I just like sat there like Wonder Trading a, a Fletchling. And then I got an Abra. I traded the Abra again and got that Abra. That's all I get on Wonder Trade is Abras. But the reason why I have that DS out, there is a specific reason for it. Because we are not Wonder Trading right now. Let me grab my stylus. We are doing something else. <laughs> As you guys know, we have a Kadabara. And I think it's time that we evolve him because he doesn't get any other moves that I necessarily, necessarily need. How do I update? Updated. I want to trade with the- God dang it, do I have to, how do I connect to- <laughs> I don't want to wonder trade or anything yet, I just want to- Connect it via wireless, no, connect for good, I want to trade. Yes, okay, I think I figured out how to do it. Yes, that's what I want. Find fairy type enthusiast, part one, <laughs> it's ongoing. Great, I am so white, I am so pale. Today is my birthday, which reminds me- I should turn off my phone because it hasn't stopped buzzing. All morning. <laughs> so, it is currently 8.30. And all morning, just people have been calling me, texting me, tweeting at me. And I have not got around to responding to all the stuff yet. And I'm going to have to go through all of it after I'm done with it. Hey, look, it's me! I'm... Why? That's not me. That's not me. I look so pale and so white. God dang, I look dumb. I'm so... Let's talk to me. Can I trade via this way? Can I borrow your clothes, please? Do I have different color... No, I have the same colored hair. I think we're good on that front. I'm so into fashion minds. What happened? Oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I'm a VIP... I'm a motherfudging VIP. Um, that's great. I don't... I, I don't care anymore. I want to trade. Link trade. I think that's how you do it. Where? God dang it. I'm going on my other DS now, too. Link trade. Wait, wait, wait. H194. Yes. H194, turn down your request. I didn't get the request. What is this? I just want to trade. Connected to the internet. What does this one say? God dang it. I just, I just want to trade. How does one trade? Connected to the internet. Trade. I have two styluses in my hand right now. Link trade. Am I on here? Update. Updated. Great. Guest list? VIP list. H-bomb. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Okay, I think we got it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was confusing to me. But this is important stuff. I actually should have got a Pokemon set up to be traded that I could evolve. Like, I have plenty of Porygons on my side. Um, Kadabra. Trading Kadabra. Wait for the other person's decision. Let's look. Is there anyone that I could evolve that will trade when I evolve them? You know, I'm not even going to bother. Just let's give him a Phoebus. By him, I mean trade, trade. Phoebus doesn't evolve from trading, but I just didn't want to go through too many of them because it doesn't matter too much. I could do this on my own time. Um, this is the nice thing about having two DSs. <laughs> you could do this with yourself. Um, but if you guys did not watch the last episode, we lost Gabite. So I, like I said, it's early in the morning. So I haven't looked at the, the stuff from last episodes. Hey, look, I got a Phoebus. Yay. Yay. Woo. Okay, we reached 150 likes on both of them. But something else that I need to check. Hello. My bad. That's me talking. That's me. Um, doors are not walls, Liam. Is there anyone recommending 
<laughs> I think I said something dumb during this. I think we're just gonna have to go ahead and choose. I think I'm just gonna swine up on my team. I see some swine ups. I see a lot of people just sad about Gabite pretty much. Use the charger bug. I don't want to use the charger bug to be honest. I really don't. Sacrifice two Pokemon to bring back Gabite. That's not how my uh, wonder locks work, unfortunately. Malasada, Malasada. I don't understand how to say that word. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna be swine up. What Kadabra is evolving? Wait, no, 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 no. Deny it, 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 deny it. Stop evolving! Stop evolving! Can you not stop Link Trade evol evolutions? I just spammed B on my other DS and it wasn't working. Oh, that's dumb. He wants to learn Kinesis? Get out of here. Keep old moves. You guys can't see any of this because all we got is a registered frickin' Phoebus over here. Hey, next. I would love a Phoebus and a Phoebus, whatever it's called, through Wonder Trading. That'd be amazing. Okay, so who do we trade again? We trade the Phoebus. Trade. And where is Alakazam? There he is. Trade. Trade. Boom. Little bit of boring stuff happening at the beginning here, but it's some... Oh. Trade. There we go. Uh, it's something that we need to do because we want our Alakazam. I'm excited to get an Alakazam. I love Alakazam. I don't like Abra. I love Kadabra, and I love Alakazam. Super strong. Bye-bye, Phoebus. I'm excited to use him. He's an Ultra Ball? Oh, oh, no, no, no. I know exactly what happened. So in my mind, I was like, I didn't... The Abra that I caught in the first episode, first few episodes was in a Great Ball, but I want to trade that guy. So this, this is why he was in an Alakazam. For a second there, I thought I traded the wrong Alakazam, and I was like, I didn't have an Alakazam on my other game. That's why I was all confused. Um, okay, once we're done with this, I could put away this DS. I just don't want to mess up anything with the communications or whatever in case something weird happens. I don't want to glitch out the game. Alakazam! It is said to have an IQ of approximately 5,000. It's overflowing psychokinetic powers cause headaches to anyone nearby. Oh, it sounds like a slow poke. Slow. Okay, we should be good. I can get rid of this DS now. Um, actually, let me... Would you like... Yes. Okay. Two DSs is too, too many to handle, unfortunately. Okay, there we go. Move that over here. Oh, great. Somebody else <laughs> texted me. <laughs> so many people. Um, but what we're going to do now is, I think, I think we battle Guzma, actually. If I am not correct, I want to look at the stats of my boy Alakazam. Because Alakazam has very good speed and very good special attack. Decent special defense. Horrible defense is the issue. I don't know about HP. I don't know how much HP he gets. 93 special attack. Is there anyone? 93 special attack. Tauros has 72 attack. I'm looking at who's my strongest hitter right now. Yeah, you're not my strongest hitter. Araquinid has 71. Marowak has 75. If we could get him the thick bone. And we're not going to use you, Charger Bug. Not for a while. Not until I'm able to evolve you. Powers up ally special moves. So, what we're gonna do... I'm pretty sure we take on Guzma with How or something along those lines, which is a scary battle, especially with those... He's got a Goliso pod. I don't think he starts off with it. No, he does start off with it, because it gets emergency exit. He 100% starts off with it to show it off, so... Like, we all get the vibe that he's got it, that kind of stuff. Um... That was weird. That was so weird. Thank you. That was awesome, but so weird. I was so... I thought, like, uh, Team Skull took over the, the Pokemon Center or something. I was so weirded out by that. Okay, so basically... This music needs to stop. This music needs to stop. It's weirding me out and throwing me off so much. We're not going to be using Charger Bug yet. We have a timid... 
I know a lot of you have recommended this as well. I didn't see any comments in the last, last episode, but I've seen people recommending me use this as well. It's timid. That means it's gonna outspeed just about anything? This is the perfect Jolteon. Okay, I saw- I feel like they're trying to put me to sleep right now, and I don't like it. Stop this. Um... That's- that's- mm. I don't have another ground type- you know, no, this is dual typing, we should go with it. We should go with it, it's got freeze dries, which helps against water types as well. I just feel like that's the better option. Hi, happy birthday. Thank, thank you, that's great. Thank you. So many people are wishing me happy birthday. Okay, Pokemon, this is actually pretty awesome. I wish you'd stop with the music, but other than that, it's pretty freaking sweet. Oh, she's got- I never realized her hair from the back of there. Thank you for waiting. <laughs> Are you going to say happy birthday again? No, fine. Will you wish me a happy birthday? Welcome to Pokemon. Oh. oh I was hoping you'd give me free stuff. <laughs> will, will the freaking Pokemon over there give me free stuff? Because that's what I'm hoping for. I feel like the quality of the, the face cam went down a little bit. This is my first time trying it out, by the way, as well. But this actually gives me... The reason why I put it over here was this gives me the option to use the green screen as well now. Because the green screen kind of got ruined with the lighting because of the whole... Uh, the, the window being right behind it. So it kind of got all sorts of messed up. So moving it over here, it should be better. But with this window, I could turn... Hold on. Stop with the music! I've had enough of that. Oh, I picked this up. Sorry, this is important now. We haven't even like done anything in the actual game other than heal. And get a swine about. Don't mind me. We're fine. I'm gonna make sure this episode goes on a bit longer than usual because I feel like we've done nothing. Now, how does this look without? Does this look better? I look darker, but is that? I don't know. Screw. I'll worry about it later. I feel like I need to get a light like right behind the camera. Is basically what I feel like I need to do. So I'll probably worry about that once we're done with this episode. But I'm gonna make sure this episode goes on for at least 40 minutes. Oh, you have a sparkling Z. Congratulations. Here's some free stuff for your birthday. No? In your bag, 37. Um, I'm going to grab some Ultra Balls. Ultra Balls are only $800? I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I thought they were more than that. Give me a Premier Ball, too. No? Fine. Whatever. I didn't need to... Stop with this music. Please. I'm like... I feel like a baby being like rocked to sleep right now. Stop. I don't want any more. Like, I love that they did something cool for my birthday. That's fantastic. Will you give me something for my birthday? No, fine, whatever. I didn't need anything for you. Okay, we're out. Stop, no more music. Stop, stop. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you, Pokemon, for wishing me a happy birthday. It's cool and all that kind of stuff, but the music needs to go. Can I not? I can't. Oh, yeah, his, his fat butt is blocking it. There's a bunch of items around here as well. If he starts off with a Galisteopod... Bug water. It is a physical hitter. Do we match up with our Araquanid? Would that be a good matchup? Mm. No, I can't bring Alakazam. I mean, I can't. I can straight up use. I can straight up use Tauros. I think that's actually my best bet. Tauros is just such a solid Pokemon. Like, as long as they don't have, like, Brick Break or something crazy. Uh, why is everyone blocking every route out? Where's the item? Where's the item? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I knew it was around here. Some rare bone? No, that's... you. That Ah, for a second I thought that was Thick Club and I got super excited. That's just something that you sell. Wow, I didn't run into a single Pokemon there. That's surprising. I want to talk to you. Do you give me something? Whatever. <laughs> I want free stuff. I'm more afraid of freaking... I'm still terrified of... I... Oh, wait. Maybe he's... maybe we don't battle him. I seriously thought we did. I just remember Guzma coming over a, uh, a freaking a thing over there. Oh, Professor Kukui. Hey there. What's going on with you two? Your eyes are shining extra bright today. Did something happen? It sure did. Professor, Professor, you gotta hear this. The altered wormhole opened up. Like, right in front of us, and there was an Ultra Beast. Right there. You gotta tell Professor Bernay. Whoa! 
You, you gotta see the ultra... Well, you got to see the ultra wormhole and ultra beast? That is amazing. Oh, yeah. You sounds like you have a better reason to train hard and for your island challenge today. So, blah, 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 blah. But, oh, yes. Yeah, so, okay. Shut up. So, this is where we take the bus to the new route? Actually, no. Did you... Oh. There's an observatory. Oh, yeah, okay. That's great. So, that's another new route and a new encounter as well. I think we got a few new encounters this episode. Which is very, very good. Very, very good. I need to get my lighting fixed up. I can't stop just being... I know that's probably not going to matter to you guys too much. Or at least a few of you will matter too, but not the majority. But it matters to me. I feel like there's something... There's an item around here somewhere as well. Uh, do the items... I f don't think the items matter too much. I swear, like, we battled Guzma in here. I seriously thought we did. Maybe not. Wow. Interesting. And I swear we go up to see, like... Oh, Lily. HR94, would you mind if I asked you something? Pew. Is it about Nevi? Yeah. Yes, I want to. I want to take Nebi to visit Ula Ula's ruins, but they're located deep in the, a large desert. I don't want to ask too much of you right now. I'm planning to visit Mele Malai Library. Is somewhere I can do this? Yep, you can go there. Um. Do I have to go to Malai Library, or can I go get a new encounter? Hey, it's Samuel Oak. Isn't wait no. Is it Samuel Oak? What's it, what do we call him in this? Are you feeling nice and comfy in that Pokedex of yours? Never better. Zzzt. Oh, hello, the Samson. That's it. I'm Oak, Samson Oak. <laughs> I'm a Pokemon researcher, and it's, I'm looking for the regional variants found around here. And you are you must be Age 94 huh? Young Kikui mentioned me to you. Mentioned you to me. Oh, Tom, you be sure to take care of this fine young boy with his island trip around here, of course. And you, HM94, I'll be trusting you for you to keep Rotom safe. Much love and pay in the Melee Library. Can you shut up? Like, I know I'm supposed to go there. I want to go to the route first. Yeah, you just, yeah, you show me which way to go. But I really, really want to go to the route. Because this route might actually matter. I'm not 100% set on, wait, is this another new route? Oh, okay. Wait. This is two. We get two new routes. There's there's one over. I don't know where this is. Route 11? Oh, I wish I could get a Pancham. Oh, he's super weak to fairy, unfortunately. Oh, I wish Pangaroo was viable. Oh, I wish Pangaroo was viable so bad. Um, I'm switching out because I don't like this situation. We go out to a Rockwinid. A Rockwinid. But this isn't like I don't like that because I feel like it's gonna use. I'm gonna call Force Palm. I feel like that's a move that he's gonna have at this level. Circle throw. Never mind. Does that throw me out? No. There's there's a fighting type move that goes last and it switches the Pokemon out. I don't know exactly what it is. Um, go for Bite. Actually, he resists that four times. Yeah, maybe that wasn't the... He still did not take that very well. Actually, just do that a few more times, I guess. Or do I go... For, yeah, go for Bite. I was thinking about Infestation, but I don't want to risk it. This is a new encounter that I really, really want. A Rekwinik can eat that up. Alright, let's do two more Bites. Or if we get one crit... No crit. He's doing no damage to me whatsoever. I love a Raquinid. I miss Gavite, but I'm still happy that I got like majority of my team still. And we got an Alakazam now. I, I don't have much to complain about, but I, I just miss Gavite. Gavite was one of my favorites. I was so excited to get a Garchomp. But you know, we're still doing a Wonderlock. We are still doing a Wonderlock, which means I, the chances aren't too, too low that I won't get another Gibble. I got him in the first place, I could get another one. And he's level 26. We always have a chance. This isn't a normal Nuzlocke. This is a Wonder Lock. It means we could get any Pokemon possible. 
Bad Champs data. We're actually getting a lot of new... Like, I love how doing this as well, because it fills up our Pokedex. So, post-game stuff, I could get... It'll help me get the Shiny Charm a lot quicker, too. A little Pokedex, 14%. It grows up in Tim... Imitating the behavior of Pangoru, which it looks up as leader. Well, yeah, that's what it evolves into. HB 94. H B 94. That's a female, too. We're getting a lot of females this Let's Play. I'm not saying that's a bad thing, of course. It's just kind of a little surprising. Uh, did we get a starter female? I always get mixed up. I always get mixed up. Now. No, I want to do the Wonder Trade now. I was thinking, like, maybe we should go grab our other Wonder Trade encounter really quick over there, but nah. I want to get this now. Because these Wonder Trade encounters are probably going to determine my team a little bit. Because if I could get something else interesting... I, I have power still. Like, I still have Jolteon. So I've decided... I'm sure that, I, that could change in the future. Like, I can't go for Flareon because Flareon is a... I don't want Flareon in the first place. But Flareon is a physical hitter. And it's a timid, so I don't want that. Um, where is he? Oh, you would have been actually nice to have. I would actually like to have you on my team. You haven't... I don't know if Pangor Pangaroo or Pang Panjam get a good moveset. I know they get, like... They get some parting shot or something weird like that, which makes them decently good. Because, like, like, pretty much you faint, and then you drop the opponent's attack and special attack. Which is good in situations where, like, oh, you're probably going to die, but you outspeed the Pokemon. BGC, not very good. Especially with, like, Tapu Coco, Tapu Lele, Tapu Bulu running around. Random Pokemon having Dazzling Gleams. It's just not... You can't run a Pokemon that's four times a week to Fairy anymore. It just makes Komo'o useless, which is sad for me, because I want to use Komo'o. But let's see what we can get from this. I'm super excited. Dive Ball? I have been blessed. Why is he in a dive ball? We're keeping him. I, I don't care. We are keeping him. I'm not... That's the rule of this. Now, dupes and species is optional. I don't think I would do it for any other Pokemon than Gibble. <laughs> Gibble or Gabite. I 100% want them. I was so excited to use them, and when I saw them go down, I was super sad. Now, the question is... Stop! I'm already done with this music. Now, the question is, do I want to hold off on using him? He's just... This is the same exact gibble that we got before. Jolly and Sandvale. Aww. Oh my god. I kind of... So now the question is... I do want to try out a new Pokemon as well. So what I think I'm going to do is he was level 26. What I think I'm going to do... Which some of you might not like. I uh, know, no, I don't want sand attack. I think I want to keep him in the PC. Because I don't want to lose another Gabite again. Because if I lose this Gabite, I'm not getting another one. Even if I get him through Wonder Trade, I don't think I'm getting another third one. I don't think I would keep him. But. Yes, I will learn Dragon Rage. Get rid of Tackle. But I kind of want to hold off for a Garchomp. So right now he's going to be level 26, and if I put him on my team, I it's going to be a long time before I get that. Which kind of sucks. It sucks a lot, actually. And the thing about Swinub is, even though I might not be able to get uh, Mamoswine quite yet, I think I need to get a Heart Scale and then go to the Move Tutor. I can attach the Evil Light on him and get so much, so much bulk. Oh, come on. Why do you learn so many moves? I don't want to learn that. I'm just trying to level you up, Gibble. Um, so I think I'm going to hold off on him for a little while. And plus, like, I want to give a new Pokemon a shot. We just... Yeah, I, I want to give a new Pokemon a shot, too. So, he evolves into Garchomp at level 48. So we have we have a long time to go. Like, everyone's at about 30, 30, 32, it looks like. 30, 31, 32, yeah. Mainly 31, 32, with Tauros at level 26. But he should be... 
He's back, ladies and gentlemen. We didn't go too long without a gap, I. <laughs> I went through an emotional roller coaster last episode. All those emotions are gone again. But I think we should use Pyloswine. Just for the hell of it. I think we should. And this is, once again, more all the more power in the PC. All the more power in the PC. I'm never gonna use... Wait, I, I did click yes, right? Yeah, I'm never gonna use Iron Head. Oh no, it's Iron Head! I did not mean to do that. I thought it was Iron Tail. Oh, Iron Head is such a good move. Oh, I need more hard scales now. That's a breeding move. I might have I might not be able to get that back. Ah, I might have just messed that up. <laughs> I just done goofed. All right. So I like I said I think we're going to keep pile or swine up for the time being. Cuz it does add a little bit of diversity to my team. <sighs> I kind of want to use them. So right now this is basically my power. Eh. Yeah. My power are these four Pokemon on the PC right now. We got Charge -a Bug, which eventually later on in the game will become Vicavolt. Gar Gabite, which will eventually become Garchomp. Eevee, which more than likely will become Jolteon. And Magikarp, which very quickly will become Gyarados. So we do have massive power on the PC. <sighs> I'm excited to use Swine Up. I am. I'm, 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 not, I'm not even going to front that I'm not excited. I want to use Swine Up now. I've already gave up my heart. I already gave up my heart. I want to use him. <laughs> like, right before I started saying that, like, the chances are still pretty high that I get a Gibble. All those birds are attacking me. Oh, okay. I thought he was just going to stop me and not let me go. I don't care. I don't care. I want to just get a new encounter. Don't battle me. Don't battle me. I'm just a man that wants to get an encounter really quickly. Thank you. Please don't be Skarmory. Please not Skarmory. Ariados, that's fine. I think it's like... I think last episode I actually caught an Ariados as well. Ariados seems to be a fairly common Pokemon right now. This is also where you get on the bus to... Do I think Rock... Yeah, I think Rock will take him out. Let's just do that. Shadow Sneak. Good move. Is this resisted? No, it's neutral. Okay, perfect. Um... Risk it. Smart strike. I thought he... Oh, he doesn't outspeed me. Payback would have been the smarter... Ah, no, it worked out fine. Payback would have been the smarter option to make sure if I got, like, a high high uh, roll or something like that, it wouldn't knock him out. But, eh, doesn't matter too much. I just took Pokeballs at him. Plus, he's a physical hitter, so... Tor and I lowered his attack, so Taurus could take any hit pretty much from him. Dang it. Dang it. Gosh, dang it. Oh, and also, I should say this. I don't know if I said it before. But if you guys don't know, if we reach 150 likes on both of my videos today, we will be uploading two videos again tomorrow. I might end up streaming tonight as well, if you guys want to come check that out. Uh, my Twitch link is hopefully in the description. I don't know what my description looks like on... I think it is. I can actually... I have it pulled up right next to me right now. You guys can't see my freaking... That's another thing. It bothered me that you guys could see, like, all my entire desk by the window. I just didn't like that. My Twitch link is not in the description. My Twitch is twitch.tv slash hbomb94. Um, if you just want to uh, netball, that does bug, right? Yes. I think Gyarados is bug. Is it bug poison? I don't know. Um, but if you want to just look up HBOM Twitch on Google or something like that, it should be one of the first things that pops up. So, yeah, just if you guys want to come check a, take a look at that. I don't think I'm doing anything tonight for my birthday. We're, uh, we're planning on going for Lumilnati's, I think on Friday or something like that, for my birthday. When, like, uh, every day, pretty much, one of us is busy. So, Friday seems to be, like, the go-to thing for us. So I think that's what we're going to end up doing. Me, Courtney, Kayla, and Brittany. Uh, I'm never going to use synthesis. And that at least gives you another type. Even Like if something resists both bug, it's likely that a Pokemon resists both bug and grass. So it's good to have the slash there too. May record level 32. Is Swine Up that low of a level? I thought Swine Up was like 25 or something like that. Alright, we got some training to do with it with you. Uh, HB 94. So yeah, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to train him a little bit, but that's not a big deal. I want to use him. I like. The other thing is like in my mind, all that I was thinking like, yeah, I get to use 
I get to use the swine up, or I get to use a pilo swine. Which is good. Like, I'm excited for that. And I have an Eviolite. So even if I don't get the Mammo Swine, I freaking have a Eviolited, uh, Eviolited, uh, Pilo Swine. Which, no four times weakness. Good typing. I don't know. I like it. I like the idea about that. I, he, he has good moves, too. Like, that's the other thing. If I could get him Earthquake, which I don't even know when we get Earthquake. I don't even know where we get Earthquake. I feel like it's on Pony Islands. I feel like it's after game, actually. Hmm. We could get him Bulldoze. That's not as good, but we could get him Bulldoze. Yeah, that's kind of unfortunate, now that I'm thinking about it. I think he's got Mud Bomb, which isn't the worst thing right now. Uh, where is he? There's the area dose. Timid, what? Uh, no, that's a horrible. I always get Timid and Jolly mixed up. Timid up speed and minus his attack. Jolly minus his special attack and up speed. So they're both the speed increasing one. You usually want to have one of the either if you want to increase speed. Like you don't want to lower defense or special defense. You want to make sure you can take hits just in case. And you want to make sure that your tech is up as humanly possible. I'm looking at my Skype right now. Since I started recording, I have five new messages. <laughs> I'm scared to go over and look at my phone. Like I really do appreciate everyone that says like happy birthday and all that kind of stuff. Don't get me wrong. I'm just scared to reply to everyone. I, I'm very, very introverted. If you guys don't know this about me, I like to be by myself. And normally when I'm like, when I'm in a talkative mood, I like talking to one person. So I get overwhelmed very quickly by that kind of stuff. Okay, that's, we gotta re-wonder trade that because we already have one. Um, I, I'm very, very introverted. If you guys have ever taken the Meyer Briggs uh, test, pretty much there's an introverted and intro uh, introverted and extroverted. I think that's what it is, extroverted? Introverted or... It starts with an E. It is extroverted, right? Introverted or extroverted? I don't even know if I'm spelling introverted right. It is extroverted. Okay. Extroverted means that basically you pretty much get energy from being around people. You like being around people more. You don't like to be by yourself. I took the, the test. Oh, I've taken it multiple times. Each time I'm very, very like you'll get like a one to 100% on where you are. The higher you are, the more extroverted you are. I got an 8%. <laughs> I'm very, very introverted and like being by myself. That's why I live alone, because I like just... I like having my own area. I like not being bothered. That was my issue with being at home, is I had always, like... Whenever I didn't want to talk to someone, is when someone would come and talk to me. And that's just when I was like, oh, crap. I don't know. That's 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 just me, though. I'm weird. Everyone knows that I'm weird. <laughs> Like, I'm not, like, I don't mean to be antisocial, I just kind of am. I'm, I'm just a weird dude, in general. I like my YouTube thing. I like, I like doing that. This is a great photo op. And that was kind of the issue with me doing videos with other people, is I like just being able to do my own videos and not having to worry about other people. Because whenever I have to rely on someone is when I pretty much get in the worst mood possible. Like, if I'm relying on someone and they're not messaging me... Okay, that's, we just got you last episode, too. Um, like if I'm trying to do a video and I need someone else for it and I have to wait for someone else or they just stop replying to me or something like that is when I just hate everything. I, I just can't do it. So that's why I try to normally do videos by myself. I know that's kind of weird, but that's just what I like to do. I'm trying to get better at that with Harmony Hollow and that kind of stuff. But I'm still, <laughs> I'm still me. Uh, Wonder Trade. I can see the phone on my corner of my eye going off. <laughs> God dang it. I'm just so popular, what can I say? Jolly and Swarm. It wouldn't have been that bad to have. Is Vicavolt... Is Vicavolt a... Special attack or a physical? I think it's a special. Maybe it's not that good to have. For some reason, I think... I'm getting mixed up with this. I never know if he's a special or physical attacker. I'm taking a look at his stats right now. Where is it? Where's his stats? Attack set... Oh, wow! He has monstrous special attack. Wow. His special attack base stat is 145. Granted, his speed sucks, which is his issue. Typing... Typing's actually fairly good. Oh! That is so much power in the PC! Yo, that's 100% gonna be a polytoad. Look at that little polywag! Oh, I didn't pay attention to what level. I'm just gonna say he was level 25. I don't remember what level he was before that. 
That's a tiny little polywag. Oh my god. Look at how cute his little eyes are. He's like, oh, really me? Oh, thank you for choosing me. My last owner got rid of me and he didn't know. He got rid of me for a charge a bug. Or a, a, a grub. <laughs> the swirl on its belly is its internal organs showing through. Ew. Ew, I didn't know that. If the swirl is tinged white, that means it's affected by some disease. Ugh. I thought you were cute until I read that. Oh, look at him. Shaking his butt. Nah. I love Poliwag. I'm so down to have a Politoed. I'm 100% down to have a Politoed. I'm not against a Poliwrath either, don't get me wrong. But a Politoed? Come on, how often do you get to see a Politoed through a Let's Play? Oh, that's just hype. I love that. We already got our encounter. Stop, please. Stop, please. Oh, eradicate. Oh, eradicate. I should... I want to get... So, I want to get... Um, I should knock you out. Yeah, I'm going to knock you out. I want to get Swine up a few levels, but I don't want to bring him out yet to battle. Just in case, like, he has Pursuit or something like that. I'd rather get... Uh, swine up up to at least 25 before I start doing that because I, I do believe that he could take a pursuit But I don't want to risk it So just on the off chance, I'm gonna let him Level up man nice and slowly through this as of right now And also this is giving experience to Tauros too. Tauros needs a bit of levels even though he's strong as hell Anyone else gonna gain any levels? No fine. I don't need you guys to gain levels other than swine up um, Before I continue I do have the Evio light right? I do. Ooh. 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 You don't get the lucky egg until late uh, after game. Actually, even is it after game? I might be able to get it before because you need to like capture 60 different types of Pokemon or something like that. And then you go talk to Professor Kakui. I might be able to get that soon. If that, if that is, I don't know if that's only after game though. I have no idea. Can I, you're just a sewer. I should go looking for clothes. I need to get my... I need to find out where that shirt is and go for it. I'm not going to do that on screen, though. Until I figure out where it is. Because that's just not necessary. That is just kind of a little waste of time for you guys that don't care about that. HBM94. I'm sorry. I ended up getting lost yet again. I wandered around completely lost until I ducked into the peril shop. And then I saw this outfit. You changed? And they said the last one was in stock, so I bought it. Even though I don't think I ever have the guts to wear an outfit like that. Oh, it's her Z-powered form. Oh my god. But the woman working started to tell me where to find the library. So I guess I could say it was all for the best. Though the library was actually right past the apparel store, so if I would have just kept going. My Yeek! It's Hapu. H1294, been a while, friend. Looks like your island challenge is coming along favorably. That must be very pleasing to the Tapu. So H1294, who might this be? Oh, hello. My name is Lily. My apologies if Musdale spooked you just now. Doesn't look like you're a trial girl. What are you up to? Oh, um, I'm actually studying for Tapu, studying the Tapu ruins for various reasons of my own. <laughs> well, that's a fine initiative. I'd be happy to show you the way whenever you'd like to go. My Mudsdale here is as sturdy as I'll, I'll get, as as sturdy as I'll get out. She can easily carry two. That sounds so weird to say. Thank you for the offer. Yeah. <laughs> Mudsdale's a cool Pokemon. I like Mudsdale. Give him an assault vest, and he's actually a very good Pokemon. Very, very good Pokemon. Very slow. A lot of Pokemon in this generation are very, very slow. Lots of very fast ones, too. But he's got, like... So, Charge... Or, Vickavolt's got 43, which is incredibly slow. I think Mudsdale's, like, 30. Which means just about everything will outspeed him. The book that I'm looking for is a very old book. Hold on. I'm taking a look at this. 35. I was wrong. It's a book that contains the old myths and legends that Professor Bernay told me about. Those tales seem to suggest the Alola's legend. You guys have no idea. I'm sure a lot of you know what I'm laughing at. <laughs> I'm excited. Because I know something is about to happen. I'm pretty sure that you, if you come over here to Samson Oak and show him a Persian? Yes. Regional variants. Physical aspect. Local Persians. Okay, so if you get an Alolan Persian, I guess you come over here and show him for, to him. And I'm sure he gives you something. I feel like you give me something. Nope. You're useless to me. Ah, you're all useless. You're nothing but a bunch of useless. P 
people. It must be a very valuable book. So I'm not sure where I'd be able to find this kind of book. <laughs> if you guys don't like my girl voice, it's happening. Come on, talk! <laughs> oh, Uncle Manu! Is this the one you're looking for, Princess? Give it a read! Oh, oh, of course. <laughs> Uncle Manu! <laughs> well, is it's entitled The Light of Alola. I'll just read it out loud, shall I? The empty sky broke asunder, a hole appearing where it had been none. A single beast appeared from it. It was called the beast that devours the sun. The king of Alola bowed before it, the beast that shone so like the sun. The island guardians fought against it, but in the end, the beast had won. When did the beast that devours the sun shine in its lights on the line of the kings? Oh, that hurt my brain. Then did the beast that had won bring nat nature's gift to bless all things. Beast of the sun and beast of the moon, through their union, they brought new life. A fragile hair in the Alola born. That island guardians would keep safe from strife. The ancient kings sang their thanks for Sol Galeo with song of flute. Two tones rang across the altar, a perfect pair ever, ever after mute. I love that little poem. It was, it was, there was a different one for the uh, Pokemon Moon as well. Isn't it great? My dad's books are all great. What? I mean, yes it is, but you say your father? Isn't this book very old? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it belonged to my dad. I know I don't like it to look like it, but my family used to be pretty much royalty. That's why I got this, I got that, I got this dress that makes me look like a cat. Come meow! I have, I have had all my bo dad's books moved here so they ruined my Pokemon. I could tell you lots of other old stories about Alola too if you're interested. Well, that would just be wonderful. I would be delighted if you would. Uh, I think I'll stay here to go back to Yula Yula Island, yada yada yada, Electrotype Trial. Oh, we got the Electrotype Trial next. That would've been good to have Garchomp in. <laughs> or Gabite. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. Um, but now we have Swinub. I'm not against Swinub at all. I'm still not against it. Okay guys, I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. I hope you did enjoy. We got two very, very good Wonder Traded Pokemon during this episode. Which I am gonna go level up. Poliwag, I think at the beginning of the next episode. So while I'm doing the intro, I'll just sit there or candy in him. So guys, be sure to come back later. Try to hit that like goal of 150 likes. If we reach that on both of today's episodes, I will be uploading two videos again tomorrow on this channel. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Get out of here. <gasps> yeah, Knuckleheads.